Playing online is fun, but there's plenty of reasons you might want to know the best offline mobile games. Maybe your internet connection isn't stable, or maybe your commute takes you underground. Whatever your reason, you've come to the right place. Thankfully, many of the best mobile games don't require an internet connection. From puzzlers to story-driven epics, here are the 15 best offline Android and iOS games you can play right now. But before we get going, be sure to hit that like button. And if you're new around here, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Now, without further ado, let's get started. Starting off at number 15, we have Burst to Power. This is an anime fighting game with vivid battles and effects from the creator of the Power Level Warrior series. Get an unforgettable experience of incredible fights that unfold right on the screen of your mobile device. This game is able to surprise with its 3D graphics and combat system, so create a team of different warriors and pass the tests, unlocking new improvements, abilities, and awakenings. Become the strongest among the fighters and overcome the difficult challenges that are sure to meet you on the way. If you've played previous games from this developer, you'll notice recognizable characters like Rizzo and Rizona, and new characters will be added over time. Now at number 14 is Cat Killer. Cat Killer is a bright and dynamic action game in which you will help the rabbit K to save his house from the invasion of cats. Once awakened, an evil deity sent his minions to the world of the main character. They sow chaos and destruction all around, and you can only stop them with weapons. Fight against hordes of dangerous enemies, use deadly combinations of attacks, and show masterful swordsmanship. Attack and destroy the enemy. Use modern technologies such as biotechs, get new weapons and equipment. Become the world's most famous cat slayer. Breaking into number 13, we have Comics Bob. Comics Bob is a puzzle game where you have to help a girl avoid a whole host of dangers. However, the protagonist is not alone, and we also have to accompany a troglodyte to move around each level, selecting the best option out of the two proposed. In each Comics Bob level, you have to make 50-50 decisions on behalf of the main characters. By carefully analyzing their surroundings, you have to choose one option or the other to trigger an action with positive consequences. If you don't choose the right option, you have to repeat the challenge until you do. Down to number 12, we have Mountain Bike Bash. In this game, you'll compete with other cyclists to see who will be the first to reach the finish line. At the top of the screen, there is an arrow-shaped navigation that will show you which way to move. Avoid obstacles in the form of trees, rocks, and other things. Choosing the safest path and push other cyclists off the road, getting additional bonuses and money for this. In this game, everything is possible. The main thing is to be the first at the finish line, leaving the opponents far behind and some even thrown off the track. At the same time, the control is done with one finger because the character moves by himself. You just have to steer. Next up at number 11, we have Alien Zone Raid. This is a great shooter with an isometric camera, hordes of mutants, as well as a cool main character who continues her journey through space stations and colonies for the sake of ridding humanity of serious threats. In the last part, she managed to clean up the objects from the aliens. Now she has to investigate and find out where they came from so unexpectedly. In this game, gamers will find dynamic and exciting gameplay, a long duration, a variety of gadgets and weapons, the development of the ward and her team, as well as high quality scenery that creates the right entourage to everything that is happening. Filling our number 10 slot is Bridge Constructor. Excellent results for mixing the two settings. Actually, everything can be seen from the name of the game. On the one hand, it is the construction of bridges. On the other, a post-apocalyptic world with the walking dead and the opportunity to meet familiar characters from the cult universe. Well, players in all this need to help the main characters overcome obstacles in their path, build grandiose traps for the horde, and so on. Beautiful graphics, the law of physics, certain tasks and conditions for their implementation, as well as many other things are guaranteed to please everyone without exception. Moving on to number nine, we have Combat Magic. Combat Magic is an action game set in a medieval fantasy world 
where two small armies face off on the battlefield. Each player can control a warrior, archer, or mage. The main objective of the battle is to kill the enemy king. However, the king is normally sheltered in the enemy base. So to get to him, you first have to face off against the other enemy soldiers. Thanks to the large variety of weapons, you can devise strategies. With some players supporting you from behind with bows, magic, and others charging forward with swords and shields. Be careful though, your enemies will also be using their own strategies. Coming in at number 8, we have Nier Reincarnation. This is the first installment of the Nier Saga for smartphones. Although it takes place in the same universe as the first two titles of the franchise, it shares neither a protagonist nor common locations. This time, your heroine is a girl in white, a mysterious character who wakes up inside a cage. As you progress through the game, you'll start to unlock her memories to discover her true identity. The gameplay is divided into two parts. On the one hand, there's the exploration part, which takes you through beautiful and varied settings. During this exploration phase, you'll find upgrades for your weapons and other secrets that help you advance in the story. Next up at number 7, we have Figment. Figment is an amazing, beautiful, exciting, and very unusual adventure project. Players together with Dusty will go on a journey through the surreal world of Dash's mind, which is constantly changing, and not for the better. The main character intends to restore balance and regain courage in order to banish the fear that has settled here. Battles with nightmares, exploring locations, meeting funny characters, humorous incidents, solving puzzles, and much more make this game a real gift for those who love non-standard travel, where every moment of gameplay captures and pleases. Down to number 6, we have Jetpack Joyride 2 the long-awaited sequel to the cool side-scroller arcade game from Half Brick Studios about a guy with a jetpack on his shoulders. New adventures are fraught with a lot of unknowns, and even more exciting for all fans of the endless concept of games. Beautiful graphics, a redesigned firing system, a bunch of enemies and traps that will become a real headache, a storyline, modes of transport, as well as much more will not let any fan of this highly dynamic entertainment get bored for any mood. Here they will find all they need in order to get rid of the boredom. Moving on to number 5, we have Legal Hacker. Legal Hacker is a puzzle game developed by Matej Vanko. The world is full of fake news, hoaxes, disinformation, and other nonsense. In this game, you'll become a professional legal hacker and silently remove all disinformation data from local newspaper companies. Remove as much data as possible, and don't get caught by guards. The game was made during the three-day game jam and available for both iOS and Android. Next up at number four, we have Baby in Yellow. This is a frightening horror game, created for Android smartphones and tablets. In this game, the user will be confronted with evil in the guise of a small child your hero had to stay with him for the night because his parents have left. And very soon, it turns out that the night in this house will be long and very dangerous. In the game, you will find great, high-quality graphics, a stylish atmosphere, a well-chosen sound design, and, of course, a lot of frightening moments in the spirit of classic horror. The work of a babysitter does not seem so difficult because it only includes feeding, playing, and putting the baby to bed. Coming in at number 3, we have Wonder Box. In the game, you'll traverse beautiful screen-sized dioramas, each box carefully crafted spaces where the adventure flows. You'll face a path full of challenges, enemies, puzzles, and platforms. The challenges, like the boxes, are limitless. You can grab your friends, create a party, and have a blast exploring together. In the creator mode, you will have all the tools you need to easily build your own adventures. Blocks, characters, and items like swords and grappling hooks. Each comes with set behaviors and allows players to easily create game content using the same tools that the developers use themselves. Next up, at number two, we have Kill It With Fire. This game gives you the opportunity to start the epic extermination of spiders on the scale of the dwelling. Citizens suffering from arachnophobia will be able to try to overcome this fear. You have to fight not a simple war, 
the enemy is treacherous and unpredictable. In contrast to the usual conditions, everything is more complicated here. You will be able to fight in a variety of ways. Do not neglect new technologies, but the old-fashioned methods can also be quite viable and suitable. Despite the simplicity of the game mechanics, we note that the excitement of the hunter will definitely capture you. It is worth remembering that spiders can lurk in the most unexpected places. And finally, at number one, we have Unruly Heroes. Now this is an action-adventure game with beautiful two-dimensional graphics. It tells a story based on the ancient Chinese mythological novella, Since the Beginning of Time, the balance between the heavens, the earth, and all the beings living there has been held by the ancient Buddhist scriptures. However, no one could stop the strengthening of the ancient evil in time, causing the delicate balance to be destroyed and the manuscripts to be torn apart and scattered all over the land. The battles themselves are very dynamic. You will need to quickly react to the attacks of opponents, dodge, and strike with lightning speed, not forgetting to use special skills. So that's it, guys. If you found a game that you like, then go to our description box. We have all the links of all the games we featured in this video. And if the game that you like isn't featured on this video, then go to the comment section and rage it out. As always, thank you so much for watching. I'm Nate, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.